I'm in my dressing gown. Yes, you are. There's a strange man in my bedroom. Yes, there is. Where anything could happen. No. <laughs> what, you find her on the internet? You go online and pretend you're a doctor? I am a doctor. Prove it. Stitch this, mate. <laughs> oh. 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 You saved my life. God, that's embarrassing. Telling me. Both working. What do you mean, both? Well, he's got two hearts. Oh, don't be stupid. He has. Anything else he's got two hearts? Leave him alone. Mrs. Tyler. Tried that new pizza place on Mintno Road. What's it selling? Pizza. Oh, that's nice. What does he eat? How do you mean? I was going to do shepherd's pie. All of us. Proper sit down. Only I don't know, he's an alien. For all I know, he eats grass and safety pins and things. Why is that up with him? My dressing gown. Oh, that's Howard. Sorry. Sorry. He keeps apples in his dressing gown. He gets hungry. What, he gets hungry in his sleep? Sometimes. Right, you've only got this until six o'clock, so get on with it. Mum, where the hell did you get that from? Rodrigo, he owes me a favour. Never mind why. <laughs> What's wrong with that? Forty. It says forty. You are forty. I don't want the whole world telling, do I? You're having a party tonight. My thirty-ninth. My official biography says I was. I tell you what, Elton. Here we are, complete strangers, and I'm flashing you my knickers. <laughs> Mum, will you just leave that stuff and give us a hand? It's food! You said we need... Just leave it! Miss Tyler, is there anything I can get you? The last 20 years back. Oh, I love you! I love you! No, oh, no, don't come! Attach this to an object and it cancels the mass. I could use it to lift two tons of weight with a single hand. That's an imperial ton, by the way. Tortured refuses to go metric. I could do with that to carry the shopping. All these devices are for Tortured's benefit, not the general public's. Rose, come to Mummy. Come on. Rose! 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 Is there any, any sort of sign? Anything to identify it? Yes! A fire extinguisher! Yeah, that helps. Right, here we go. Nice cup of tea. Mm, the solution to everything. Now stop your moaning. I'll get the record. Manage a glass of champagne. Or a nice cup of tea. Oh, that'd do me. <sighs> the amount of things that needed doing. And then, it'd be really brilliant if I met someone called Alonzo. Because then I could take Alonzo, Alonzo, every time. You're staring at me. My mum's still on board. If we end up on Mars, I'm going to kill you. These are from the girls in the office. Happy birthday. I've got hand-sculpted arrangements by Veronica of Reykjavik and your secretary stopped off at a garage. I don't think so. And if you're giving out presents, where's my Zeppelin? It's weird, these few... So you heard me. Get out! When did it start? Well, first of all, Peggy heard this noise in the cellar, so she goes down. No, I mean worldwide. Look, you didn't even notice, did you? Special delivery. Got sent round today. Birthday present from Mr. Lumick. Latest model. Diamond studded. Pick up signals from Venezuela. Why would you want to pick up signals from Venezuela? Well, I don't know, but now I can find out. <laughs> That's all 
all I needed. Cup of tea. I said so. Yes, sorry. Good point. She's just a bit shy, that's all. But here she is, Rose Tyler. Mm. She's not the best I've ever had. A bit too blonde. Not too steady on her pins, a lot of that. Oh, I'm having a neuron implosion. I need... What do you need? I need... Just say it. Tell me, tell I me, need... tell me. Painkillers. I need... Do you need aspirin? I need... Codeine. Paracetamol. I... Oh, I don't know. Paracetamol. I need... Liquid paraffin. Vitamin C. Vitamin D. Vitamin E. I need... Is it food? Something simple. Bowl of soup. Nice bowl of soup. Soup in a sandwich. Oh, yes. soup in a little ham sandwich. I need you to shut up. Oh, he hasn't changed that much, has he? It's Pete from a different universe. There are parallel worlds, Jackie. Every single decision we make creates a parallel existence, a different dimension where... Oh, you can shut up. I'll have to trade her in. Do you need anyone? She's very good at tea. Well, I say very good. I mean, not bad. Well, I say not bad. Anyway, lead on. Allons-y, but not too fast. Her ankle's going. I'll show you where my ankle's going. Jackie Tyler, Rose's mum. Now, where the hell is my daughter? There we go. Fixed. <sighs> Here we are. A little reward for my favourite handyman. I shouldn't really have got the car outside. What, you could always splash out on a taxi or whatever. Now we can fly this thing. No, Jackie, no, no, not you. Don't touch anything, just stand back. All those daft little plans of mine, they worked. Make me rich. I don't care about that. How rich? Very. I don't care about that. How oh, very. <laughs> the only one who hasn't been through the void? Your mother. First time she's looked normal in her life. <laughs> Oi! Come on! All of you, top floor! That's four or five floors up! Believe me, I've done them all! Now, I'm not giving a speech. That's what my parties are famous for. No work, no politics, just a few good mates and plenty of black market whiskey. <laughs> <laughs> Pardon me, Mr President. So, yeah! Oh, fat lot of good this is. Back of beyond. Bloody Norway. <laughs>